Okay, hi everybody. We should be capturing game footage now, but uh, we're not for some reason, so I'll be back. And for some reason it didn't turn me off, it turned the other bit off. So, have you guys got any audio? Sorry, we've just switched over technology because this is being very temperamental, but it doesn't appear to be booting any audio through. So, if you just bear with me, I will just check what's going on here. You can probably hear me okay. Bourbon Buck, hi, nice to see you again. Oh, hello, hello, hello. Yeah, there's probably going to be a little bit of echo, but can you hear the game audio? That's what I'm more after. Like, there's no music coming through or anything, is there? It's because I've switched it. So we basically, because we think there's a there's an issue with the lag, uh, so we're tinkering with... Nope, that's not done it. Also not done it. <laughs> Hmm, no game audio. No game audio. And that is quite important for this game. Uh, right, audio input. Ah! Now? Now are you hearing stuff? Yay? Nay? Thumbs up, thumbs down. Quite a bit, of the, but you can still hear audio. No? Okay. This is very, very strange. Right, okay. <laughs> so basically what we were going to do was, uh, but you can hear me fine, right? You can hear my, my voice well enough through this. I'm going to guess yes, because people have answered me previously. So, yeah, so, thank you, Bevan, thank you. Uh, yes, yeah, so, although distorted, is that a bit better? Is that a bit louder? Yeah, see, the, the the audio keeps jumping in and out, and I'm really not sure what the reason is. It's like, it's showing that it's appearing here, and then it's disappearing again. So, um, we will be back. We're going to have another, we'll probably be on for about another hour or so, just to do a few other bits and bobs. So, um, bear with us. We will be back as soon as possible. Okay, see you in a bit.
And hi, I'm back. So, hopefully, we should have some game audio. Should be hearing the very cool sounds of Matthew Walker's amazing soundtrack. No game audio still. Okay, we have one more plan that we should be able to do. No, thank you so much, guys. No, we're really sorry this is going... Everything else is running fine. All the other bits seem to be working together. It's literally just getting the sound audio to work together. So, who knows? Who on earth knows? Right, we're going to try one more thing, and we'll see if we can get this to work. So, guys, thank you so much for sticking around. Do appreciate this. Uh, we'll be back on in just two ticks. And, oh, hello. <laughs> Ruin the illusion there for you all. Hang on, let me... <laughs> I moved backwards too far. Let me just go fix that uh, gap in space-time continuum. <laughs> right. Oh. Right, hang on, I know what I've done here. I've moved the seat and this has pushed this whole thing forward. But welcome to the stream that keeps on giving, eh? And there's music, and there's me, and I'm sitting down. And I fixed this hole in the space time continuum. Hello, everybody. My name is Matt Davis. I'm the marketing community manager here at Aura Digital. And we are streaming Dark Future Blood Red States, which came out today. Uh. Okay, awesome, thank you. Cool, cool, cool. Right, um, I'm going to pick up from where Peter Willingson, who was on the stream just before us, uh, was having a go at the stream. Now, we uh, we were on earlier, but the problem that we had was that there was a little bit of a technical snafu where the frame rate was dropping in and out. So we've had a bit of a PC swap. We've put this stuff in here, and uh, we are now ready to rock. So I'm just going to... Just going to... Pull this bit down here just so I've got all my audio stuff fine. I'm just going to make sure my chat window's up the front, which it is now. Do, 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 do. And we're back in. Okie dokie, so how is everybody? It is uh, 10 30 or 10 40 now, gosh, uh, UK time. So we are based over in Bristol and we are talking about our brand new game, which is this uh, Dark Future Blood Red States. So this is like. Um, yeah, this is really exciting because we've actually just actually just launched this today at four o'clock, which seems oh a little while ago now. <laughs> but um, yeah, it's it, it's been going well. People have been jumping online, talking about it, giving it a thumbs up. Um, we're really really excited about it. Really happy that it's come out. Um, it's been a long journey. Two thousand and fourteen was when this product uh, project was started, and now we're here showing it off to you in the world today. So we are currently. I'm I'm basically picking up Pete's game. So we're playing as a brain in a jar literally a brain in a jar and what we need to do is complete a data heist mission so that's what we've got down here which you can't see underneath my head but it does say complete data heist missions to complete this objective so for those of you who haven't seen dark future before this is a car combat action strategy game so it's a bit different to anything else you might have seen before uh, what type of mission did we say we needed? We needed to do data heist. So let's dive straight into a data heist. Okay, so I didn't actually check what Pete's decked the car up with, but we'll work it out as we're going along. That's what we'll do. We'll just we'll just work that out as we're going along. So, <sighs> da -da -da. how was everyone this evening? Evening, morning. Tell me where you're from. That'd be lovely to see. Look at that big old, big old trash heap. What did uh, Pete put as his license plate? Fresh. 
Nice. Nice. Right. Okay, I was uh, playing on your. Uh, I was playing on my last one with one of my. Um, with a very, a very, very specked out machine. So, it'll be very interesting to see how we do with a. Less specked out machines, shall we say? What have we got here? You are on. Okay, your f rear is now gone, and you. Oh, you're still pretty healthy, aren't you? Okay, let's see if we can speed up and get in front of these guys and keep out the way of. Right, okay, bit too fast. Ah, cool. Good to see you then, Space Boy. So, is Strategy Games your thing? Games Workshop stuff your thing? Because this is actually a Games Workshop title, if you can believe it. From back in the day, 1988, when this originally came out. Oh no, run straight into some pipe bombs there. Very helpful. Good job, me. Okay, let's get to the back of this, so let's go to the front here. Yeah, okay, cool. That's got this Vorta vibe to it as well. I did quite enjoy uh, FTL. But this is the future of Blood Road State. Oh, and we are trying to avoid a giant laser on the edge of a rocket. So, we're going to pop in here. So, the aim of this mission is we need to try and hack this. Uh, yeah, Cold Wars, it's got that sort of got that sort of vibe. I wish you did better, we were talking about this before, weren't we? On the last stream. Okay, right. So as you can see here. That's what we want to do. Match. So this option here is the match speed one. So we're trying to like basically I'm trying to make the car go for huh, go into that zone. Let's go a bit faster. So basically I've got to speed up. Get into the right place, so yes you can. You can paint them. And when you unlock the top tiers of things, you'll start getting uh, different chassis with different stuff on it. So right, this is where I'll, I'll lock this in and then he's gonna move within like Oh no, it's gone over. Okay, we can catch up behind them. Okay, we're gonna. No, keep going, keep going, keep going, we're gonna slow down. Also, don't we need to shoot the truck? That's another thing, so. Come on, let's take her this way. Lovely. Too fast. Match speed. So when it goes yellow, you can obviously see that I'm going to be. Uh, actioning it. Get a bit faster now. 120 should be enough. Spell some pipe bombs behind us. Trying to. This is good. This is all right. I'm quite happy with this. Also, as you can see here, as I'm as I'm hacking it more, the vehicle is now kind of becoming under my control. Right, now we're going to match speed with you. Oh come on dude. Okay, um, do, 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 do. if anyone has any questions you just feel to uh, drop them in. There we go, that's what I want to see. Now right, I'm going to start aiming at you. Get my laser around. So this game is available now if you are watching this and you're joining us for the first time on the stream. This game is out now. Brand new. Oh no. You too can have the joy of trying to chase a truck around a post-apocalyptic nightmare world. Boom. Yes. 
Sorry. Sort of, <laughs> sort of used a little bit of a glitch there, which is to kind of jump in front and then press the brake on it, so the car smashes into the back of you. But hey, if it works, it pays those bills. So, all right. One thing I am gonna have to do before we do anything else is change the color of this car because I want to add a. Yeah, let's add a. See, yeah, so who was asking about it before? Tyden? Tindian? Sorry if I got your name wrong there. There we go. There you go. <laughs> uh, what's the opposite of that one? Is green or blue? There we go. Cool. All right. There we go. Much nicer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you've got a whole rear colour range of stuff to work through. So it's not just like a generic set down of stuff. So um, we're going to complete this objective. I don't know if he actually spoke about like uh, the different mission stuff where we just sort of dived in. I just sort of start playing. I just sort of start going through and just having a good time. So our next mission is we have to earn 750,000. Oh, excuse me. 390, we just kill off a couple of gangs. 260, 390. Yeah, let's see that one. Let's do some stomping grounds. Mm -mm -mm -mm. So, um, big thank you as well to the guys from Games Workshop for uh, helping us put together the. Uh, the being a, helping us be a part of the Skull Cell. We're really excited to be a part of this with all the other incredible developers who are working on some cool stuff. Big shout to Nomad as well, thank you very much. The guys who were on way before us back at like four or five o'clock. And the aim of this mission is just to kill as many things as we possibly can. So let's see if this will uh Oh this guy's got a flat cannon in front of him. Okay, so that grunts, you see you've got here on the corner, his uh, his rear armour is down. So we want to try and get behind him as best we can. The other guy is full armour, so... Oh, ouch. Oh, and we got two in front of us as well. Oh, goody. This cannon is going to be a real nightmare for us. Okay, front arm is usually the worst one to be able to deal with, so you gotta. Okay, let's see if we can clear out some of these guys up front. That might make our lives a little bit easier. Whoa! I'll drop that pipe bomb down. Let's try and move this around. So, whoa! <laughs> So, uh, one of the things that you can also do in this game is use this wonderful cinematic mode to uh, capture all the ridiculousness of this game in high def beauty. And then you can pop over to Steam and you can drop it in the artwork channel because it looks very, very cool. So, are you guys having no trouble with the lag? Everything's coming through like fine. Oh, no, busted the laser. So, stream all good? Excellent. We were having so many nightmares earlier with it. It was, just a, it was a real ache. So, yeah, switch over a PC and that appears to have solved it. Still not dead. Oh, ouch. I'll do the same. <laughs> wow, so, yeah, that went well. Okay, what's this guy got here? He has got a front. Okay, let's switch over to the next lane. Yeah, the audio will echo a little bit. It's just this room, basically. But I will try and talk closer to the microphone, so... If I put that there, that might be a little bit better. 
Boom. Boom, 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 boom. Alright, let's see if we can get... Oh, those flat cannons are a real ache. Nice, got one more. So again, we're just trying to kill as many of these as we possibly can. Front on is too good. And boost through both of these guys. Ka-ching! There we go. So, oh, close is worse. All right, okay. Uh, all right. Is that a bit better? Well, it's, a, it's the problem, because basically we've got... I'd show you the setup, but we've got like a load of soundproofing stuff around us, but like... Because we, we've got where the, where the space-time continuum is behind me, uh, it just bounces stuff off of it every now and then, so it does make things a tad, tad annoying, but we will endeavour, we will get through, so. Okay, so we need to earn 750, we've earned 390, so let's find ourselves another one of these. What's this? Damages. Uh, destroy enemy robo trucks. Oh, 390 for doing a blockade run. That's right. You'll also notice as well when you play this game, and if you are thinking about picking it up, you should uh, definitely check it out. But you see here, there's different skulls. Those represent the difficulties and the level of difficulties as you go through. So uh, level two is obviously harder than level one. Level three is harder than level two. Uh, but the, as the difficulty goes up, the reward goes up. So, you know, for greater risk, you can get stuff. So, yeah, we're going to do this one. So, um, blockade runs are not easy. That's the wrong word I want to use. So. Hmm. Alright, sorry, it is 11 o'clock, it's way past my bedtime. Okay, so, let's get through these blockades. Sounds doubled. Let's have a look, see. How about now? Does that sound better? Yeah, there we go. Thank you very much, Catherine. Oh, absolutely, Space Cow, Space Boy. <laughs> I'm very intrigued that, I mean, uh, essentially the game will work around a certain couple of precepts, but at, as you develop, you're gonna have to go through and compete against different, different, uh, da -da -da, sorry, I mean, distracted here towards the same time. Uh, you're going to have to go up against uh, different types of enemies. There's going to be mutators involved. So each of those will change. So you've got um, enemies that like drive into you really fast or do whatever else. And then you've also got the different sort of like final missions that sit within there. So the problem when you switch tech over is very helpful because the stream is going to do so much better. But what well, it doesn't help with it's when you set up all the other stuff like your audio, so. Alright. Boost this one out. So, uh, yes, in, in short answer, Space Boy, Cowboy, yes. And people who only played it for a few hours are probably missing out on quite a lot of it before they say it's super terrible. Whoa! There we go. Bust through into here. Bring this one out. Wow, these guys are really keen to... I've never really had two games the same as well, so that's uh, that's another thing to point out there. And there's just so much to explore and just look at. It's like, yeah. And for 14 quid, which you can get it for now in the sale, it's not bad. Okay, we are going to have to do some help here. Okay, I need to check on you. Oh no, side this one. Oh, I need those pipe bombs. Okay, boost ahead, get out of the way of these people. God, my rear is. Hey! I'm completely insane. Well, you know, I'm certainly enjoying it. I mean, you know, I do work for the studio that made it, so I think it's quite cool, but um, I think there's enough in there, and especially if you're in that. FTL sort of vibe of things as well. There's so much of the story and the mode you need to be able to read and find out about as well, so. Oh, smashed into that one. 
Uh, yes, there is a tutorial. I don't play them when I do these streams of these just because I've played it too much. But there are a few other YouTubers and other streamers who, who do uh, pick up the tutorial and various other bits. But yeah, it takes you through the whole the base start of it as well. So. Whoa, smashed into that one. Oh no, now. So what will happen is my card's flipped over. And I should get this, which is a recovery cost. So I can pull it in, but what I need to do is pay out of my mission thing, which is slightly annoying, but... Okay, let me just whiz this round here. This car's getting in my... Let's get out of the way of this one. Yeah, and like I said, there's uh, there is the uh, there is the twenty five percent discount. Okay, let's see if we can cross in here. Okay, my laser is actually trying to target and fire at people such as that thing that's in the air right now, so... All this mission I need to do, actually, I don't really need to fight all these cars, I just need to zip through... ...and get to the end. There we go. Whew. Whew. We did have to get a, uh, a pickup, though, so that is slightly annoying. Right, we just jump into this. It's going to do its calculations. So I'm just going to take a quick moment to go over to. Hmm, da, 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 da. So, yep, 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 yep. So, yeah, you can. Uh, so, as I said, we are part of the, the lovely skull sale. So, you can uh, go and have a look at that. And we are at the top of that at the moment, still. Very exciting. Um, cool. So. Yeah, so I don't know how much more, we'll probably go for about another half hour or so and then we'll see see what we'll do, but, um... So... Oh, tank! So if we didn't get, if we didn't have to get, um, picked up, we could have done that mission. Ah, that's annoying. That's so annoying. Okay, uh, we'll do an escort, but before we do that, I'm gonna invest heavily in gas. Because that, I'm always worried that it will get something that pops up that says, oh, by the way, it's, oh, I've lost the chat. Here we go. Chat's come back. Here we are. Oh, dear me. Sorry, everybody. That was a big yawn. Look at the slit colors of that going against each other, so. Okay, uh, we still have someone behind us. Yes, we do. There we go, got rid of him. Nice and easy. Done. Okay, so uh, anyone here not here when we did the first hacking run? Because if so, we got to do is we've got to stay within this yellow box, and this yellow will just keep going around with different ones. There we go, still in. Now I'm going to speed up. Put a little bit, bit of a cheat here, which is I'm going to put the brakes on. And then smash into the back of me. It's alright, keep the hacking progress going. See how my 
much of this we can get. We need to get, oh, we only need to do the one truck at first. So some of the later missions you have to do like three or four and it does get quite technical after that point. So can we do it? I might be able to spam this one. I only need to get 10 Ks. So we're just going to race on to the next one anyway. So, oh, that way, that way, that way. Slow down too much. Come on, come on, come on, come on, go, go, go. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Boost, boost, boost. We're so close. Okay, let's go, go, go. Uh, we'll be back on uh, stream this week. We'll be back on uh, Monday, actually. So, uh, do come and check us out there if you are interested. I'll be joined by my colleague Nina, who will be having a go at this game, not for the first time, but for one of the first times. So. Okay, so slowing down now. Oh no, I forgot to set the laser. Definitely too tired for this now. So we've got six minutes, so I'm not rushed too much to be able to do this, but yeah, alrighty. Alrighty. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, uh, wrong window here. What's this up at the moment? Oh, that's trying to play some audio there. That's a bit funny. Don't know why that's happening, but. See, now, as I said before, sorry to everyone who's just joining me here, as I was saying, as I was saying before, sometimes I like buy, buy extra fuel just for the sake of it because this comes up because you end up jacking up the price for everything, so. Oh! Yay! You did it! <laughs> uh, actually, just completed the season. So, now that I've completed the season, we dive back into the main game. And now what I can do is open the next character. So I can move on to this one and I can look at the T-Bird. So for those of you joining us, so yeah, it does feel quite nice actually. There is quite a nice little customization between the two of them. But um, so within this, this field now, you've got all the different characters. So you guys are all getting a little bit of a special treat being able to look at it. So obviously this is our first mission, Brain in the Jar. Uh, next character we're going to look at here is uh, Micah, Mad Micah, who's down here, the T-Bird, and you'll notice that that's the enemy card they're in, so um, you'll find out a bit more about her when we actually do a stream with her. Uh, you've also got the Sanctionop, the Jaisai, it's a very cool looking car here. The Trader, um, and you can actually see his Pro variant has this rather slick decal to it. Uh, the Lawyer who, uh, his basically, you see his pro version, his standard version doesn't have a turret, and then his pro version does, so that's quite an interesting combination of the two. Uh, also, that's the lawyer. Uh, the gambler, who also has a very cool, very appropriate for the skull sale skull. There is actually a giant skull on the top of his car anyway, so. Uh, there is the cyber op, and then there's my favorite characters in this one, which is the Sunday driver. So again, as you, and I can't talk too much about those those guys at first, but it's probably better just to have a look at it this way. So, um, so how many people we got? About nine or ten people now, haven't we? So, then we're just rocking in the rest of it. So, right, okay, um, probably a good place to leave it here. We're probably going to uh, see if see if we can harangue anyone else to be back into it, but um, if not. We'll see you guys very, very soon.
How's this working? Is this working all right? I don't know. Hmm. Hello, hello. Is this working all right? I don't know. Hmm. That's better. All right. Okay. Hello, hello. Okay. I think this is working all right. So we've got another little bit, and we're going to uh, stream Dark Future for a little bit longer. Thirty k and what to spend it on? Let's have a look. Ah, oh, fuzzy dice. Now I've got front and rear weapons, so I think I'm going to go with explosive damage. So we're going to intercept the next Robotron. No, we're not. We're going to put the old... That thing up for a second. Let's see what's going on.
I reckon before I need to take on the boss. Oh, unfortunate. Go and find some more enemies. Oh, there they are. Pop some mines down. 
by laser and then hopefully follow that up with a ram in a bit. Oh, I might not need to. Ah! Oh, core repair, core repair. Okay, so I'm going to use that to try and build up my repair again. No, 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 no. That's the end of the run. Mmm! Permadeath. Ah, season terminated. Well, we'll take, we'll take another crack at this. She's a different character, I reckon. Um, let's see, loaded out with. Uh, that's quite fun. That's quite fun. Trader? Yeah, let's go, Trader. Thank you, Planet Buster. Let's go on damages, but first. Let's make some nice color change. Ooh. Do that damages mission. Okay, I think what we'll do is match speed with that. Pop some mines down just in case. And then now we play the waiting game. Ah, like grenades. Oof. Alright, so that's got rid of that. I can now use a score of the enemy can now use the oh turret to lock onto this instead of the enemy ah. Light mines out. Oof. I know I've got some enemies in front of me, so we'll get rid of them. Hopefully, get rid of them. lost all of my rear armor. Okay. Let's see what happens now.
for his armor now. There it is. Ah, they missed. They missed with the ram.
should start to be enough. Uh, but they're going to try and evade it, and that's not going to catch the mines. So I think I'll try and get behind them. There we go. There we go. Ah. Core repair. No, I think this might be the end of the run. Certainly getting close to it. Oh! Well, I think that is probably going to be it for our stream today. Uh, thank you very much for joining us, everyone. Hope you've liked Dark Future. And uh, yeah, bye now if you get a chance. Uh, thanks, Planet Buster. Go pull White Dwarf 45 from the 1980s shelf now and compare the ad on the back. Guys, name the look of the game, the cars. Only took 30 years to get it to play it. Excellent. Uh, yeah, so um, it's on sale now and we hope you really like it. So uh, from myself and all of the Auroch Digital team, uh, have a good evening wherever you are and uh, yeah, see you in a bit.